In this video, we are going to discuss examples on pick commands. So at first, we are going to discuss for each and generate command. So the for each operator is used to generate specified transformations based on the column data. So the syntax of for each will be like this. So variable name is equal to for each table name generate and required columns. So variable name is equal to for each table name generate and required columns here. So to execute this command, we need to use the dump command also. Next one is a filter command. We know that using filter, we can see only the specific selected row, rows or the records. The filter operator is used to select the required tuples from the relation based on a certain condition. So the syntax will be like this. So variable name is equal to filter table name by the respective conditions. To execute this command, we need to use dump. Next one, we are going for this order by command. The order by operator is used to display the contents of a deletion in a shorted order based on one or more fields. And the syntax of this will be variable name is equal to order table name by field ascending or descending. So either I shall be using ASC or DESC and then semicolon. The ASC means the ascending order and DESC means the descending order. To execute this command, we need to use dump here. For the better understanding, let us go for one demonstration to show you that how these commands can work in practice. Now in this video, we shall show you that how to use for each and generate command in our grand shell. So the first query we are going to execute is that display the name and the city fields for all rows. So that means I, would, I do not want to uh, print a name, major and city, all the three attributes, all the three fields. I want to display only the name and the city. That means it is, it is giving you a flavor of projection where you are selecting some of the columns but not all the columns. But all the rows will be coming. So display the name and the city fields for all rows. So at first I shall go for this uh, for gen. So that is a variable name. You can give some other name also. So for gen is equal to for each student generate city. The order in which you are mentioning here in the same order it will be coming. So I shall go for this enter. So for each student generate city comma name. So now I shall go for say dump to see the content dump for gen. So we are having five rows. You see all the five rows are coming, but the major is not coming. The department name is not coming. The subject is not coming. There is a major. The city is coming and the name is coming. You see the same command. So it is immaterial whether you are typing this one all in the capital letters or not. So there is immaterial here. Intentionally, I'm changing this name, the sequence, there is the name and the city, making this one name and city. If I press enter, then dump, dump for gen. So now the name is coming at the front and then city is after that. So names are coming and then the cities are coming for the all rows, for the all five rows. Now, next we shall go for the filter command. So let us consider one query, display the student information where the city is Kolkata. So how many, how many uh, rows are there with the Kolkata city? Two rows are there, Amit and Kushal. Okay, so display the student information where the city is Kolkata. So now here I'm going for the selection operation. Okay, so how to do that one? So I shall go for say Kol, Stud. I can give other name also, so that is not an issue. So Kol Stud is equal to filter. I can write this filter in the capital letters. I'm not going to show you that one because I've shown that one earlier in case of for each and generate. So by city double equal to within single quote Kolkata. You see in the table we're having the Kolkata K capital. So call stud is equal to filter student by city is equal to is equal to Kolkata. 
so i have executed this one now i shall go for this dump call city call stood rather i shall go for this call stood we had two rows with a kolkata city name so they are amit and kushal let me check once amit and kushal so they are having the city as kolkata and rest of them are having different cities so now let us go for uh, we are going for shorted output so short city in the ascending order so i shall go for say city order i can give other name also city order is equal to order this order can be written in the capital letters also so student by city ascending okay so i shall uh, do this and then i shall go for dump city order i shall go for dump city order so they'll get ordered in the ascending order alphabetical way in the alphabetical ascending order you can find so we are having this chennai then delhi kolkata kolkata and mumbai so they are coming in the alphabetical order so the command was this so i can make this one as descending i can make this one as descending so dsc so that can be done pressing enter now go for this dump city order so now now the cities will be coming in the descending order so mumbai will come at first kolkata will come ne next in this way the ordering will be done so mumbai has come at first then kolkata has come next then we are having the uh, city like delhi and then chennai is coming at the end so that is our ascending and descending order so i've shown you both now let us show you one advanced query so what is the query the list the city and the name of those students who read computer science so now you see it is having a flavor of both uh, projection and selection so you want to have only projection on two attributes that is the city and name and you want to have the selection only on the department that is the computer science so let us work on that okay so here you see we are having two uh, two rows are there with this computer science so i want to access their respective only the uh, name city and the name so roktim will come delhi will come dinesh will come chennai will come so i require only the city and name of those students who read computer science so how to do that one i shall go for this computer student i shall go for this computer student is equal to filter is equal to filter student then by major is equal to so at first i'm doing the selection so that is a filter so student by major is equal to computer science and that is getting assigned onto this comp stud so let us give one semicolon there okay then i shall go for the city and name i shall go for the city and name then i shall go for for each com stud so the outcome which was dumped onto this com stud after doing the filtering generate so there is a generate we use that one earlier also so city i'm putting that one at first then name i can also reverse the order i can also reverse the order so now it is coming like this okay so i shall go for this dump city name so i'm expecting uh, delhi raktim and chennai dinesh will come so chennai dinesh and delhi raktim so it they have come accordingly so in this way i've shown you that how to use this respective uh, filter and then we have gone for the advanced queries how to execute them so we have shown that one into details so to exit from here i can go for this quit i can come out from this grand shell thanks for watching this video